That's enough out of you. So this is your Western chivalry. I warn you, young man, I write to my congressman. Oh, thank you, ma'am. I'll sure appreciate that. I might get some new ideas. Andrew, he's even insulting. Is it really a hold-up? What does it look like? Oh, here's the ten dollars I owe you from the pinochle game. Quit your shivering. Nobody's gonna hurt you. I, I ain't shivering, mister. <laughs> I'm just laughing. <laughs> I, I just paid my honest debts. <laughs> Put your money away, pal. I don't want it. Uh... Sorry, Mr. Collins. But your party would have to come along with me. Andrew, tell this person who we are. I'm afraid he knows, Sarah. Oh, don't be scared, Aunt Sarah. Me? Scared of a man? Well, come on, let's get moving. I got you. Wait just a minute, hold it right where you are. Hey, this isn't your party. Hey, what are you putting in for? You weren't invited. It was a hold-up, wasn't it? A hold-up, nothing. Just a little reception that I had planned for Mr. Collins and his guests. I'm sorry to have detained you. You see, Miss Collins, your father wrote me how keen you were about this wild and woolly western stuff. So I thought you'd be tickled. I am. Almost to death. Andrew, who is this man? Well, uh, he's the manager of my ranch. You're a manager? Mm. And you pull such childish tricks? Ridiculous. Well, now, you see, lady, uh, as a matter of fact, I didn't... Uh, uh, the whole situation is this. Now, you see, what I was going to do... Andrew! Is... Yes? And you know I have such a weak heart. Oh, dear, I forgot. Guess I made a fool of myself, miss. But I thought it was real. I thought it was real, too, mister. Well, Howell's the name. Blaze Howell. I'm awful sorry I busted your party up. I'm glad. It was rather childish. Except for your part, Mr. Howell. Well... We're going to be at the Cackles Ranch for some time. Won't you come see us? Gee, I'd be glad to. I'll look forward to it. Great. Hey, conductor, conductor! Conductor, conductor! Conductor, conductor, conductor! Take it easy, Porter. What's the matter? What's happened? The messenger am dead. Dead? Yes, sir. And the safe is done blown open. The safe blown open? Yes. Sir. Was there any money in it? About fifty thousand dollars. Fifty thousand dollars? Well, the only stranger that's been around here is that interfering cowboy. I think we better hold him, fellas. Let's see if the ranch, right, man. Let's get him. Come on. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Doris, come out from there. It's none of your business. Doris, you listen to your aunt. Now, this has gone far enough. All right, Dad. Running after a cowboy. 